it's Jamie here and welcome back to my channel Reviews by Jamie. Today I'm going to do a Birchbox first Ipsy bag today and these are always fun to do. I haven't done one in a little bit. I've been opening them up on my own and it's, it just doesn't have that same excitement where like I get to show you guys too because I'll see something and I'll be like oh I really want to tell them about this and I can't. I'm gonna start with the Birchbox. So I think the Birchbox, I'm not sure if it's like a wedding themed one because it says say yes and that's not really a good slogan to just have, like, say yes, you know? Shouldn't it be, like, say no to, like, drugs and pressures and other things? You don't want to always say yes, but I feel like you would say yes to, like, a dress or to a proposal. I'm not going to read the little cards because that just ruins all the fun out of the surprise. Okay. Oh, I need this. <laughs> this is Temple Spa in Good Condition Hair Conditioner. Uh, press shampooing. I'm assuming that means after shampooing. Post shampoo treat to leave hair in mint condition. I wonder if it smells minty. It does! I knew they weren't just gonna put that out there if it didn't smell minty. Okay, I love that minty smell. And it's usually only in shampoos. Oh, it's the shampoo for that. So, Temple Spa Good Hair Day Shampoo. I really don't shampoo my hair that much because it's really curly and dry and I've been going with like that no poo kind of thing for a little bit now and I seem to like it. So I do have to use it sometimes. So this will be good to keep when I do need to shampoo. L. Erickson. It's hot outside. Keep your hair up with these must have ties from L. Erickson. I can always use ponytail holders. It actually seems pretty nice, like it's wide enough. And I like that it's brown because it matches. So even though it's not like the coolest, I actually do like it. Next, Marcel Hypoallergenic Waterproof Eyeliner in Blue Lagoon. So it actually looks kind of pretty. Oh, it's a really pretty uh, metallic blue. Something that I might do like on the bottom lash line or just like one half of the lash line on the bottom or top, I guess. So yeah, something like a little beachy. Is this like a beachy kind of thing? Like say yes to the beach? I don't know. So that's it. Well, not that's it. <laughs> that's it except for in here. <laughs> okay. What's this? Oh, I thought it said, I literally thought this said ugly people. And I was like, what is this and why did they send it to me? Well People Expressionist Mascara. I've not heard of this before. Looks like a mascara. It looks okay. Um, I have like a lot of mini mascaras lying around and I just switch off using them. And then this is Super Goop Play Everyday Sunscreen Oil-Free Face and Body Lotion. I like this. Super Goop is a pretty good brand. I've only tried a couple things from there. But other, a lot of people seem to really like it, and I love an oil-free sunscreen. It still smells like sunscreeny-ish, which I love. I love that smell. I feel like I went through it really fast. I don't know, like there wasn't that much to look look at. Like it's more things that I'd have to try on my own time. <laughs> oh, I kind of thought that mascara. It says it is all natural pro-grade mascara that lif lifts and lengthens lashes without chemicals or dyes. Just like the name of it, Well People, sounded like it would be natural, which I really like. My preferences for Birchbox says that I want more natural things, so they listen. They always give me good, like, more, like, chemical-free kind of things, so that's really cool. Next up is the Ipsy bag, and I looked at the Ipsy bag when I first took it out, and I was like, oh, how cute. I love the colors, and then I turned it around, and it says Ipsy all over it. Why did they have to go and ruin it by putting, like, that label all over it? I don't want people to know this is my free Ipsy bag. This is like a really pretty color. I want to wear it everywhere. <laughs> okay, so let's see what we got here. <gasps> it Cosmetics. Oh my gosh, this is really nice. I actually watch It Cosmetics on QVC like all the time and they really look like good products. So I'm so excited right now. It's so cool. Brow, it's their universal brow pencil. It's big, like it looks like the full size one. That's so cool. The color looks amazing for me. I really like this. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Off to a great start here. <laughs> What's this? Smashbox foundation primer. Oh, that's really nice too. Especially in the summer when like my makeup wants to just like smear off. The other day I was so hot, I couldn't even put my makeup on. Cause like, 
it wouldn't have like stuck. <laughs> so next up is this. Is this the cap? They is like such a trick. <laughs> the cap looks like the thing. Isn't that weird? Some people might like literally not know that's the cap. And they're gonna be like, this stuff doesn't show up. I picture like 80 year olds doing that. I don't know if they <laughs> received the Ipsy bag. So this is Tristique Mini Shadow Crayon in Venetian Gold, which is a really pretty color. Ooh, and it's really creamy. Like it goes on really nice. Oh, I'll definitely use this. Okay, next up is this. This is, oh my gosh. This is a really good Ipsy bag. This is La Vanilla, Pure Vanilla, the Healthy Body Butter. Okay, so La Vanilla brand is really good because they're like a more natural brand. They're really good and they make perfumes and stuff and I actually have one of their perfumes and I think it's like the Vanilla Passion Fruit or something and it's pretty good but I was always kind of mad that I didn't just get the Vanilla Vanilla one because that's like what they're more popular for and they have deodorants and lotions and stuff and this is so cool that they gave this. It's kind of like a musky vanilla and like Here's the thing. It's not my favorite vanilla smell like the Bath and Body Works warm vanilla sugar is my favorite But for something like really natural that you feel good about putting on it's really nice So this is formula X nail color. It sounds a little dangerous formula X <laughs> Gotta watch out. Oh That's a pretty color. So they did good. It's like they knew me this time sometimes they don't know me at all, you know, and they're giving me like Really weird things like yellow glitter nail polish and like yellow eyeliner. This would be nice on my toes or whatever. I actually, I did this big mix up the other night. I was getting ready to go out and it was actually like this kind of like nicer party thing that I had to attend. And I got my nail polishes out, a white one and this one that's on my nails. And this I was planning to do on my toes and the white on my nails. And then for some reason, I did it the opposite way and I was like so mad about it and I still feel really off balance from it. It's really pretty. Don't smell nail polish. Well, that's it for Ipsy vs. Birchbox. I'm pretty sure Ipsy won because I can't even remember what came in the Birchbox. There might have been something. I don't know. That Birchbox is not very memorable, but this Ipsy had a couple of things that I'm so excited about. So definitely goes to Ipsy. So let me know down below in the comments what you guys got, if anything was the same or if there was anything that you got that was better than what I had, so I can be extremely jealous. And I'll see you guys on my Instagram or Twitter. Follow me. I'll leave the links down below. See ya. Bye.